Hey y'all! Hey. We are so glad you're here today. We, I mean, we're winding up the, the all fall, y'all. Yes. We are winding it up. Yes. And but we can't forget Thanksgiving. No. We've been doing fall, and Thanksgiving is fall. Yes. So sure we're is. still doing fall, but we want to just take a second today to just be thankful yes. for what the Lord has done to us for us. Yes. And the things that he's done, he's given us. Oh my gosh, he has just blessed us yes. like you would not believe. So today, I want you to just sit down, take a deep breath, let it out, and just think of everything that the Lord has done for you. Yes. This has been a crazy, crazy year. But you know what? We're still together yes, and we are. we are still just pressing on and the Holy Spirit is still leading us in the direction that he wants us to go in. Yes. And so we're very thankful for that. So yes. Paul and I just want to just say thank you. Thank, thank you. you for thank being. Thank you very much. Thank you for being our buds. Yeah. Some of you, we don't even know, but you're our buds anyway. Yes, you are. So we just thank you for that. Yes. Now, if you're a master crafter, we want to just be able to stimulate your brain and get you thinking about how you can do your decorations this year. Yeah. But if you're just looking at us and thinking, I'm not a crafter, but I'm going to see what y'all do. Yes, yay. you are. Sit down and get comfortable. <laughs> get yourself a Dr. Pepper because, girl, we're going to teach you that it is not so hard to no. craft. You can do a little bit of anything you have in your brain will come out. If I can do it, you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> and if you go to our good old places like the Family do uh, the uh, Dollar Tree, yeah. Family Dollar, Thrift Family store. General, all the thrift stores, yep. then your crafts are not going to cost you so much. That's right. And today we are going to the Dollar Tree, or we yep. went to the Dollar Tree, yep. we've got everything ready. Almost everything that we got is yeah. is uh, Dollar Tree related. Yeah. So, cost us dollars. That's right. Not much. Not much at all. So, we're going to get started. And we're going to do things a little weird today because Paula is going to do... Oh, yeah. I'm Vonda. She's Paula. Hey. <laughs> and we're scripture <laughs> DIY. You might want to know that. That's right. But um, we're just... She's going to start out with one. Yes. And I'm going to do my take on what I thought I, mine might want to look like. Right. And so we're just going to just play both right. of them. Don't forget this. That's if right. If you like our craft. Be sure. If you like our craft. Please do this. Yes. <laughs> please do. Okay. Yes. So now we're going to get started here. Yes. And um, we both have chargers yes. that we got from the Dollar Tree. If you don't know what a charger is, let me get all my stuff off of here. They're just these plates that you see. They have them everywhere. Dollar Tree, Walmart, Hobby Lobby, Michaels. But everywhere. they're not a dollar anywhere no. else except for the Dollar Tree. Right. And it says on them, can you guys see that? Charger plate. Yes. I don't so, know why they call well, because what it actually does is it helps enhance the decoration of your dinner plate. Yes. So if you're sitting down for Thanksgiving, you've got some cute. Mm -hmm. I guess you know we do put paper this plates down first. You do that, and then the dinner plate, and then you deck around, decorate around it. But crafters so. like to decorate them, and yeah. then they take these these little what do you call these things? I forgot already. Uh, picture plate. holders. Yeah. And then they put them like this after they've decorated them. So that's what we're going to so do. So that's what we're going to do. All or right. they hang them on their front door or on the wall or lots of different things. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So just be thinking, what are yeah. you going to do with yours? Right. Right. Speaking of, what am I going to do with mine? <laughs> so mine is like a wood. They've got like a wood um, grain to them. And mine is like goldish or wood tone. And... Is that my cue to go? Go for it, girlfriend. <laughs> okay. That's what we're here for. Okay. So, also at the Dollar Tree, they had a three-pack. Um, oh, I guess I don't have the pack anymore. Okay. They had a three-pack of these words. Okay. They said harvest. Um, can you see that? Oh, sorry. Wrong one. There we go. Harvest, uh, welcome, and thankful. 
So they were a three pack for a dollar and they're metal. Now I chose Harvest and I spray painted mine um, outdoors in this. We got this from Lowe's and it's Krylon and it's in gloss burgundy and it turned out really pretty. And so I think on this wood glow cone, it's gonna be really nice, it's gonna pop on there. Okay, so we are going to um, hot glue this onto the plate. And then we might wanna stick just a little bit of each 6,000, which That's I'm right. just now thinking about. She's gonna grab that. Wow, let's see, we've got our, yep, we've got our handy dandy glue gun heated up. And so, we're also going to put some other things on here, you guys. So we've got also a bag of acorns that came from Hobby Lobby. You can get a bag. This, this remember, use your 40% off coupon that you can get online. This bag said $9.99, but 40% off is close enough to half off. $6. Yeah, yeah. And we also had a package of leaves um, also from Hobby Lobby, I believe. Yep. This leaves, these were really cool looking leaves. They're kind of metally looking and shiny. Metally. Metally, yeah, metally. Metally. Metally, $4.99 if you go separately. Are you making up your own words I'm, like I do? No, I do that I sometimes and my know, husband goes, that is too. that really a word? I know, but it sounds good. It sounds good, <laughs> metally. Yeah, they're kind of metally. Not yeah. meddling. No, we will no not, not metal. We in won't meddle in yeah. your business, no. Okay. <laughs> and they're $4.99, but again, if you go another day, or maybe go outside and come back in. Or take your know. friend with you. Take your friend, yeah. That's, yeah. that's right. 40% off coupon. Or right now, I think all the fall stuff at Hobby Lobby. Pretty was much is all 40% 40 off. off. Yeah, yeah, last time I went there, 40% yeah. off. So, yeah, so off $4.99. So, you know, you get the drift. Okay. Yeah. So start gluing, sister. Okay. So we're going to glue. Going to glue our letters on here. And, uh, Jenny. Hey. Hey, girl. Okay, so we're going to put hot glue. Oh, we should have put the 6,000 first, huh? Yeah. Ew. That's okay. Okay. We can do it right now. Okay, we're going to do it all together. So you can put that. I'm Just don't do glue that. my fingers. I won't glue your fingers. We're going to let her, because that, the hot glue the um, e dries fast. Yeah, the E6000 is what is actually going to be holding this on. Yeah. So we're going to wipe this off that just yeah. dried. I always forget. I always jump in with the, the hot e glue The E6000 is your glue. Yeah. But your um, your hot glue, yeah. and I just made a mess. Your That's hot okay. glue is what, go for it. Okay. Is what's going to just hold, hold it in place. Immediately. Yeah. Um, if at all possible with your E6000, upside down, E6000, you need to let it cure. So it's best off if you wait for like 24 hours if you've got a chance to do that. Okay. So I'm just going to flip it over and stick it down. Okay. And your tea looks like it's not, there you Hopefully go. Might need to kind of bend a little bit with yeah, the place. Yeah, bend a little bit. It's not quite, it's just a tad bit bigger. And some of the so. glue, um, the hot glue is a little much in spots, but that's okay. When we're through, yeah. we can just um, get peel a little knife and just kind of cut it, around it, peel, it. That hot glue peels off really easy. I'm telling you, yeah. you can't mess this up. Yeah. No. Unless you glue yourself to the tape. Right. That would be good. Okay. Okay. Now, she's going to let that sit just a little bit. Yeah. And so the next thing you're going to do is? Then we have um, options. Okay. <laughs> so I talked about leaves. So we have these pretty metally leaves. And I have options here. We've got other kinds of leaves too. I thought it would be really pretty if we put some leaves. Um, i got to get my the wipes. We've got some glue sticking out, and I thought we better wipe that off. Invest in wipes. I think yeah. I've told y'all before. Yeah, baby wipes. They're cheap. Gotta have them. Just get a box, and especially with glue that's running out, it'll be good. Okay, so we'll just wipe off that glue. Okay. And it'll be fine. We can touch it up when we oh, get yeah. through. Yeah, so it'll be okay. Okay, there we go. Okay, so. I thought it'd be really cute if we put some leaves at the bottom of, like that, okay? So we have options for you guys. So we have the metal leaves. We have these leaves. I have some other ones somewhere. You have puppies, puppy sticker leaves. Oh yeah, I have leaves. puppy sticker leaves. Yeah. Okay, we'll take a look at these. 
also came from, oh, were these Hobby Lobby? Yep, Hobby yeah. Lobby, again, $3.99, but they were probably on sale too, because they're fall leaves too. So we have options here. And then I have some of these puffy things. Puffy things. Puffy things. What are these, like little balls? I don't oh. know. So we're trying to decide what to decorate the plate with. So, and we have a bow that we know we want to put at the top of the thing. So, so why don't you put the bow at the top? Yeah, I guess we can put that we on can, first and then we can, we can, can see. Yeah. Yeah. So let's put that on first. Can I fluff it while you're getting you it? You can the fluff plate, it. The, the yep. Glue out. Yep. So we'll take these out. And this and we'll was see. just some leftover ribbon that we had from another project that we did. Yep. In fact, I made a big bow. Yes. And it didn't look right, so I right. just threw it in the box. And the good thing right. about having some that has the wire in it is that you can just fluff it and make it look really pretty. Yes. Now, I'm not a bow maker, so what I do is I just float, cut it like so, uh -huh. just make a circle out of it, right. and then tie it in the middle. Right. And let it hang down. Yes. So, mindless work. Okay, so we're ready to put the bow on. Go for it, girlfriend. Okay. Just put a whole big O. Whole big O. Heaping help of hot, hot glue. Hot glue there. There we go. There we go. All right. And, and if, she's going to put that on. If you'll hand me that, I will get another, another stick, stick ready going. for you. Yeah. I know you're going to need some glue. I'm going to need some more glue. Yeah. Yeah, so we're going to let that dry for just a second. And then we want to put, like I said, leaves at the bottom. And you guys can see. See now how far we've gotten. That's and cute. Got, and I always go backwards. There we go. And maybe leaves at the bottom. Okay. So we've got some. We've got Honestly, some of these. If you didn't have any leaves, that's pretty cute uh -huh. just by itself. It is kind of cute. Yeah. Kind of plain. If you like them more plain, then um, you could just just stick with that. But you know me. I like lots of stuff. Plus, our show would only last about 10 minutes. That's right. That's right. So, <laughs> so we can't do that. So, we can do other things. I've got these leaves. What do you guys think about that? But I think there's too much of the maroon. What do you guys think? And I think the other leaf kind of like blends into the plate. What do you guys think? I think we should go look at some more options, don't you? Okay. Let's look at some more I options. I like the middle myself. Yeah. So then we've got these, the little puppy sticker leaves. So we'll look at a couple of these. Maybe if I can grab them. Okay. I think these guys are too little. What do you guys think? Yeah. Those are too little. Do you guys think? Yeah, I think so too. Okay. All right. Let's look at, let's look at these. Here's the metal ones. But I think those are the wrong colors because these are, that one's the same color as the plate. Okay. What do you guys think? Well, that orange really makes the ribbon, the orange and the ribbon pop. And I it like really the does. little pop of green. Yeah. What do you guys think about that? So you always need to look at things differently because yeah. certain colors make other colors pop. Yes. Yep. I like the green and I like the orange. That looks awesome. Okay, so I think we're gonna go with that. Now these have a little bit of a metal thing on the bottom. We're just gonna fold it up so you can't see it. I think that's a stem. Yeah, oh yeah, thank you. It's a stem. <laughs> it's a metal thing on the bottom. It's a metal thing on the bottom. Yes. Okay. Horticulturists so call that. A stem. A stem. Okay, we can get a little stem out of the way. Okay. What do you think? Yeah, that looks good. Okay. So we're just going to hot glue that on there. And I think we should use the E6000 yes. again. Yes, you do. Yeah. So let's see. Let's do that one first, maybe. Yeah, since his stem is sticking out a little more. We'll do that first. While you're doing that, I'm going to peel off some glue. Okay. Just because that's what I do. That's what she does. Yes, I can't stand tape or anything like that. Here, y'all. I don't like tape stuck on something. It yeah. just drives me absolutely nuts. Yeah. If you put tape on something and you didn't, you didn't remove the tape when you got okay. through. Let's see if that, see how that's going to stick on there. Okay. Ooh, that's hot through that leaf. I bet that metal really mm -hmm. condensed mm -hmm. that. It does. Heat. Yes, it does. Okay. That's good on the first one. And this is one we might want to be careful when we pick it up that we, yeah, don't pick it up too much. Mm -hmm. 
Um, with, mm -hmm. her, with her glue, we might need to just wait and show a picture when yeah. it's over. Yes, we might. But we'll see what happens. That, I mean, don't, <laughs> don't overestimate, ever underestimate hot glue. Right. Hot glue works wonders. Okay. Maybe a little there, maybe a little there, and a little there. I would just do a whole big old blob right there next to that uh, glue if I was you. Just blob. There you go. Okay. And we're gonna do it like that. Okay. I use my finger now. Hopefully it won't. Run. I got those finger things. I know, and I didn't open it. She did. She, here's those little finger things we keep telling you guys about. We finally got them. Forgot to open them up beforehand. I won't use them anyway. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I already think I don't have fingerprints, so. Yeah. No fingerprints. I seriously, my phone, you can open up with a um, code or a fingerprint. I went to use my fingerprint the other night and it wouldn't open it up. Mm. <laughs> so, so, yeah. Okay, I think that's on there pretty good. And then I thought just for a little um, added decoration, we could either do like a little cluster of acorns, these little guys, because we have the bag of acorns. Um, and where did those come from? Those came from Hobby Lobby. They were Hobby Lobby. Yeah, they were the ones yeah. they said were nine ninety nine. They were six dollars after you yeah. got your discount. Yeah. Or we had some little loose acorns. Uh, no, not acorns. Those are pine, pine cones. cones. Yeah, um, from some project that I saved the pine cones. We could do those, but I think the acorns. I don't know. What do you think? I like them. The acorns. Yeah. So let's just glue. Or if you're from East Texas, those are acorns. Acorns. <laughs> she says. What do you say? Acorns. I say acorns. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, let's see. How, which way? You got to get the true Chapel Hill out here. Anybody else feeling my pain here? <laughs> <laughs> she says. Heather's going, oh my gosh, she Mother. H-I-L-L. -L, how do you say that? Hill. I say hill. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, my grandson gets on to get, me all the time for hill. Yeah. You get, you get different different languages from both of us <laughs> that's okay that's what makes the world go round. <laughs> okay let's see here let's just oh just pile a big old heap of yeah we're gonna pile a big old heap and bunch of glue do we want to use both kinds i think so i imagine okay i let's keep see. putting the lid back on it i, I think you got it backwards though didn't i did turn it turn it around which way this way and then we got that little metal thing showing. Well, maybe the metal thing, but I think they yeah. need to poke okay. out oh, some. Oh, out the other way? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right, I'm fixing to hit you with some glue here. Okay. All right, then I'm going to put some like that. And then there. mash it on the sides. It pushes that glue back down in there, and it's not quite so okay. hard to open next time. Oh, there we go. Big bunch of glue. Okay. I think that is really good, just like that. Just like that. Yes. Okay. okay no fun. more stuff. I think we that's should just lots of stuff. Let it's it plenty. sit by itself yes. just for a minute. We'll do the big reveal here in just a minute. Yes. Yes, we will. Yeah. Okay. Because those acorns right don't look like they're gonna <laughs> um, set. It's gonna no, take a while. It's gonna while. take a little while. Yeah. Because yeah. this one on the bottom wants to come up. So. Yeah. We're gonna let him set for a minute, and then okay. we'll show this to well, you. Well, I'm gonna set this bit. over here to yeah. the side, and then Vaughn is gonna show you hers. She's got a totally different take on her charger plate. Yeah, but while I'm doing this, she's gonna get the scripture out. Yes. Did you guys see our scripture of the day? Okay. Before we get started, I have a yes. gray one. Same place, Dollar Tree, mm -hmm. just gray instead of wood, and it's wood grain. Right. But it just doesn't have the gold in it. It's just gray. Yeah. Okay. And so, we have um, some friends at A Maker Studios, yes. which has the just awesome stencils. And we'll put a um, link down below in our comment section. Yes. This one says, Waymaker, Miracle Worker, Promise Keeper, Light in the Darkness. Yeah. So, if you guys want to buy that stencil... All you have to do is click on the link that we're going to put below for you after the video, and you can purchase that, that stencil for yourselves. And the stencils are mesh, so like yes. there's no hole, 
no in there not There's, a hole at all let me show you the front side of it yeah they are so awesome and then when you get through with them you just throw them in some soapy water yep and that's it yeah and you Put can them. use them over and over and over again yes. yeah now, they are awesome stencils what i like to do the very first time that i'm doing a stencil is i fuzz it put it on your shirt fuzz it up i mean they'll sell you or a, a towel. little towel or a little blanket mm -hmm. or whatever right but i just soon yeah. use my shirt because yeah. it didn't cost me anything this was a free shirt anyway so we got this from our refresh dream team at our church Rose Heights. so so yeah. so so it's our women's ministry at our church we're just going to stick it in the middle and we are going to be using a maker summer melon chalk art mm -hmm. um and it is a, to me it looks more pumpkin uh -huh. yeah. than summer yeah so this is what we're going to use we're just going to be scraping it on there yeah. so i'm going to put it where y'all can see it while she's crawling yeah, and we're gonna put a link to that paint um, on there too. So if you wanna buy the paint, you just click on the link and you can get that paint as well. Same company. Yep. And, and my maker. little scraper thing is gone. Uh-oh. There it is. There it is. She found These it. These come with it too. Yep, with the paint. They're usually bigger, but I just cut them because I want smaller ones. Yeah. Okay. So today's scripture was from um, the book of Isaiah, chapter 54. And verse 17, this is awesome First, you guys, if you saw it. Um, no weapon formed against you will prevail, and you will refute every tongue that accuses you. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and this is their vindication from me. That is an awesome verse. Love to quote that. Anytime you feel like that you're under attack or things aren't going right, um, quote that verse, no weapon formed against you shall prosper because that, that, you know, anytime that you quote God's word, um, that's, that's armor. Those are weapons. You guys, um, God's word is alive and it's sharper than any two edged sword. And the enemy has to flee and leave you when you quote God's word against him. He has to leave you alone. He has no choice. Um, God's word is is a powerful weapon against the enemy. He has no choice but to leave you alone, flee away from you. And that's why um, it's always so important to memorize some of God's word, at least, you know, at least try to memorize some key verses that you know that can help you. Um, you know, we were just talking about it earlier. Um, we don't know a whole lot of people that aren't under some kind of attack right now. Yeah. Um, we have people who have COVID. We yeah. have We have friends whose whole family yeah. is COVID, you know, yeah. affected. Um, we have people who don't have the, the yeah. jobs that they have. Yeah. You think about it, y'all, the whole world is, the entire world is under attack right now. Yes, it is. Yeah. Um, if you if you read scripture about um, the end times, the enemy's desperate because the end times. I mean, if you read it, everything about the end times is going on right now in our world, and so the enemy knows that his time is very short, and so he's desperate, and he's throwing everything against all of us that he can that he can. So. We have to to be watchful and aware. Vigilant. Like, vigilant, yes. Um, like the word tells us. And so um, we've just got to be, we've got to put on our full armor of God, like, like Ephesians chapter 6 says, um, um, starting at verse 10, 10 through um, 20. Um, God tells us, be strong in the Lord and his mighty power. Put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. Um, for our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world, and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. You know, there's a, there's a war going on, y'all. There's a battle going on in the spiritual realm. Um, we can't see it. But just because we can't see it doesn't mean that it's not going on. 
Um, there is a real battle going on and and it's so important for us to um, read God's word, memorize God's word. You don't have to memorize every single word, but it is so important to memorize key verses. Um, wow. Oh, the baby wipes. Yep. Sorry, I was trying That's not okay. to interrupt you. It's okay. Um, because you're going to need need some of God's word to shout out loud, speak out loud when you know that you are under attack, when you know that um, you feel like, like the enemy is getting the best of you or when he's um, trying to get to you. Um, if you feel like, you know, um, like your thoughts are just really bad thoughts, start, start speaking God's word and, and get your thoughts back under control because it'll help. I know it happens to me. And sometimes you know what I, I like think, to start out saying? What? Not today, Satan. That's right. Not today. That's it right. ain't happening. Not exactly. today. Exactly. And then I start thinking about the scriptures that apply. Yeah. But right off, I want to tell him. Not today. Not today. Yeah. yeah. When I feel, sometimes I feel um, condemnation. And there's a verse, there, there will be no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. And when I start repeating that verse over and over, immediately I do not feel condemned anymore. Because he has no choice but to stop condemning me. And it works, y'all. It really works. Um, you know, read about the armor of God. Ephesians chapter 6. Um, he gives us armor, real armor to put on. Um, and then... If nothing else, if you if you feel desperate, just say the name of Jesus out loud because there is power in the name of Jesus. It's real. And if if you just are desperate and you don't know what to do, just say the name of Jesus out loud. Um, Let the Holy Spirit take over from there. Yeah. Because yeah. once you do say, yeah. um, once you ask for help, he's there. Yeah. He's going to help yeah. you with your words. Yeah. Um, Philippians chapter 2. Um, verse 9, this tells you how, how much power there is in the name of Jesus. Therefore God exalted him, speaking of Jesus, to the highest place and gave him the name that is above every name, that at the name of Jesus every knee should bow in heaven and on earth and under the earth, and every tongue acknowledge that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Um, there is so much power in the name of Jesus that if you're if you're feeling desperate, weak, no strength, whatever it is, and you just don't know what to do or say, just start repeating the name of Jesus out loud. And um, you know, Jesus promised um, he when he died and rose again, he gave us not only salvation, he gave us his strength, he gave us peace, he gave us healing. I mean, so many things, and um, we need to remember that. And it's in God's Word, and He promised it, and God does not fail on His promises. So, that is really beautiful. You should see this charter plate, y'all. It looks Just awesome. Just got it done, yeah, too. She what does. Good timing you have. Yep. No, nope, not my timing. It's God's timing. God's timing. Yeah, He makes it awesome every time. You know, we pray at you all every time before we start the video, and... We say, Holy Spirit, just give us the words, and it's amazing, because he does. You have been prayed for even before you knew it. Yes, you have. Yes. Ah, oh, this is beautiful. Wait till y'all see this. It's, it's gorgeous. I kind of want my gorgeous. ribbon to be a little... A little long? No, a little and, wrinkled. Yep. Look, isn't that awesome? Yeah, it looks great. So, yeah. All right. So, I think hers has had time to sit good mm -hmm. enough. Yep. So, oh yeah. There's. I wouldn't throw them around, oh, but yep. be kind of gentle okay. with them. Okay, we're gonna be gentle, or their corns might fall off. Okay. Do you see them? Can you see both the plates? You go. You go. You go down. I'll go up. Okay. Okay. That sounds good. How about that? There we go. Do you like them? 
Do you love them? Give us some hearts. Do you want to make them. one of these Should like make this? Some. You got to. They're a dollar at the Dollar a Tree. A dollar at the Dollar yes. Tree plus our stencils. Christmas time, they come out with Christmas colored charger plates. You guys can do some Christmas stuff with them too. I wish I'd have bought just a whole bunch of these just, just yeah. for the heck of it because I like the wood. Yeah. But definitely. these are cool. Yeah. Okay, remember, if you like our crafts yes. and you want to see forget. more of them, go up do to the this. top. Hit follow, so yes. that, then we'll just we'll just call you and let you know. Yes. Well, maybe we'll <laughs> tell you on Facebook yes. that we're going to be live, so you don't yeah. miss us. Yes. Um, we do read comments, so if you'd yes. like to bring to send us a nice con comment, <laughs> honestly, we haven't had a bad one. So right. we 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 do read our but comments. We do like um. Constructive criticism, yes. Oh, yes, we, we do will take that, yes. <laughs> but we can answer any questions that you might have. Yes. And yes. Um, be sure and, like I say, give us some hearts or just do this word right do here. That. that will help us better with than anything. With your family and friends. Sprinkle. Sprinkle with your family and friends. All right. Yes. So we thank you so much. We thank just you. enjoyed just sitting down and playing and having a good time yes. with y'all. Yeah. So, and talking about God's Word. Talking about God's Word. Nothing yeah. better in this world than God's yes. Word. All right. So, everybody remember. Love one another. <laughs> Thank you. Say it.